or the banks are broke. They're broke because we have a system called fractional reserve banking, which means that banks can lend money that they don't actually have. It's a criminal scandal. We have counterfeiting, sometimes called quantitative easing, but counterfeiting by any other name. The artificial printing of money, which if any ordinary person did, they'd go to prison for a very long time. And yet governments and central banks do it all the time. Central banks repress the amount of interest that rate, rates are, so we don't have the real cost of money. Us underneath all this, we talk loosely, in a rather cavalier fashion, do we not, about deposit guarantees. So when banks go broke through their own incompetence and chicanery, the taxpayer picks up the tab. It's theft from the taxpayer. And until we start sending bankers, and I include central bankers and politicians, to prison for this outrage, it will continue.